Welcome to the Q&A session about the library's move to Helm. Helm is Higher Ed Libraries of Massachusetts, and it's a really exciting opportunity for the STCC Community College Library to expand its resources, student-centered resources, on a large scale. Um, this will be a quick Q&A session, but I'll make a short presentation to talk about the highlights of this exciting transition. HELM stands for Higher Ed Libraries of Massachusetts. It's relatively new. It just started in 2017 and already has 13 members. Um, by, the end, by June 1st, when STCC officially joins, there'll be 12 community college libraries and one state college library. It's good because there's also local options. Hoyle Community College is also a member now and Berkshire Community College will be a member. Another good thing about Helm is it seems to be growth oriented. So I don't think it's gonna stop with these 13 members after June 1st. And there's a lot of opportunity for collaboration among the, the community college libraries. There's also shared collections. For instance, if you see a book you like in the online catalog from HCC, you can get it delivered to STCC, but more about that later. Now, the shared collections of the STCC library are closely aligned with the academic users, specifically community college students and faculty. The whole mission statement of Helm is to keep academic users paramount, to really focus on, focus their collections towards academic users. All the resources in the Helm Consortium are accessible through a common online catalog. For instance, like uh, CW Mars had a common catalog where you could get books from Springfield City Library, Longmeadow Stores Library, Chicken Public Library. Here you can get a book or resource from any one of the other community college libraries. So for instance, if Berkshire Community College had a book you were interested in, you could request it in the online catalog and pick it up at the STCC library circulation desk in building 19. Getting a book is as easy as going to the shared catalog and doing a search for, doing a search for instance, the invisible man. You can see we have the entry and it's definitely requ requestable just like in the CW Mars catalog. You click place hold and have it delivered to your current library. STCC library. How will the transition impact borrowing? Well, that's a good question. You'll still be able to borrow STCC books, laptops, books, Chromebooks, and hotspots the same way you always have been with your STCC RAM card. You can check it out at the STCC library circulation desk in B19. All member libraries will have the same online catalog like, like we've just seen where you could search for all the books in the STCC catalog and all the books and materials and all the other cons member libraries. So you can search for books in the Berkshire Community College Library or Holyoke Community College Library. You can request those materials be delivered to our library for pickup. It's pretty easy. You could also use your RAM card if you want to go to HCC library and study. You could check out an S a, a Holyoke Community College Library book with your STCC RAM card. Now. The good thing about this change is that you get access to 12 community college and state college libraries. If you have your own public library card from Springfield City Library or Chicopee Library, you can still resource, you still access the resources of CW Mars. We can also help you borrow CW Mars materials if you come to the reference desk in building 19 second floor, or if you can contact us virtually through the contact information on our front page. Uh, remote reference can help you get materials after we make the transition on June 1st. This is an exciting transition and there are many opportunities for collaborating amongst member libraries, amongst sharing collections. It really expands our library by 12 times the size. You get access to 12 community college and state college libraries. 
and it's really student focused, uh, community college student focused collections. This is a wonderful opportunity and a lot of potential for continued growth and collaboration. We have a web page set up for questions and answers. If you go to stcc.edu slash library and scroll down on the lower right hand side, we have a question and answer page and other resources that discuss the transition to this new li library group, Helm. There's a Q&A, there's an introductory video, and this presentation will be shared on that site as well. There's also an opportunity to provide feedback. If beyond this Q&A you have any questions or want to submit some suggestions or just heap, heap praise on the library or criticism, you could do so by clicking this link and providing anonymous feedback. But uh, we're, open any, we're, op we're open to questions anytime. Email, you can leave a voicemail and we'll call you back. We can access it remotely. Or you can call the remote reference line during our open, open hours, Monday through Thursday, 7.30 to 7 p.m., Friday, 7.30 to 5 p.m., Saturday, 10 to 2. And we'll answer your question in person and live. Thank you, and uh, keep the questions coming. We'll help you any way we can. Thank you very much.